the best climate models predicted would happen in 150 years is happening right now. Scientists have acknowledged their models are failing in the face of the ongoing abnormal changes. These models can neither explain the causes of natural disasters nor protect people from their consequences. Alatra International Public Movement, a unique phenomenon of our time. 30 years of interdisciplinary research, 20 international forums, 150 languages of translation, 180 countries, one unique climate model. Years of interdisciplinary research by Alatra scientists have led to the creation of a unique, comprehensive model that predicts the escalation of natural disasters. This model forecasts the accelerating increase in climate and geodynamic anomalies on our planet. To date, the progression of natural disasters fully aligns with its forecasts. Alatra's scientific activity is unparalleled. It conducts interdisciplinary studies of climate and geodynamics, encompassing everything from processes in the Earth's core and crust to the oceans, atmosphere, historical climate cycles, and climate changes on other planets. This comprehensive approach allows for a holistic understanding of all factors impacting our planet. Alatra offers more than predictions, it provides solutions. The Alatra scientific community has already proposed concrete steps and technologies to help minimize the impacts of the global climate and geodynamic crisis. These innovations are designed to protect the environment, cities, industries, businesses, economies, and most importantly, human lives. Alatra's achievements are recognized globally. The movement is the organizer of major international climate conferences and forums. Alatra experts are sought after speakers at key scientific venues worldwide, including the United Nations. Government bodies in various countries invite Alatra specialists to host roundtables and provide consultations on climate-related issues. Alatra has become a significant participant in UN climate summits. At these summits, Alatra experts present Alatra's scientific reports on climate and geodynamic changes, showcase documentary and popular science films, participate in international discussions, foster global collaboration in combating the climate crisis. Alatra's noble work and meaningful contribution to society earned the blessing of Pope Francis during his pontificate. The path of Alatra has been far from easy. To date, the only country in the world that has banned the movement's activities is Russia. For over 20 years, Alatra scientists have studied the global threat posed by the activation of the Siberian magma plume. For more than a decade, Alatra participants have openly discussed the true scale of natural disasters and emphasized the dangers of the Siberian magma plume. However, this truth turned out to be inconvenient for certain power groups in Russia. They fear that the country's population and the global community might learn about the real threat of a Siberian magma plume eruption, and this information would undermine their personal profits. To suppress this truth and prevent its dissemination, participants in the movement were subjected to significant pressure. Alexander Dvorkin, President of the Russian organization RACERS, Russian Association of Centers for the Study of Religions and Sects, led a campaign to discredit Alatra scientists and the volunteers who support them. This persecution extended beyond Alatra, targeting other groups deemed undesirable by these circles. Despite smear campaigns led by Dvorkin's agents in various countries, Alatra volunteers continue to raise awareness about natural disasters, driven by their commitment to protecting the future of their nations and defending their fellow citizens' right to life. After 2021, when scientifically grounded forecasts about the threat of the plume's eruption were made public, the persecution of Alatra participants in Russia intensified. In 2023, Alatra was declared an undesirable organization in Russia. 
This decision was accompanied by raids, falsified criminal charges, torture, and multiple detentions. Hundreds of participants were forced to flee Russia and seek refuge abroad. Certain power circles are so afraid of the truth voiced by Alatra volunteers that they spend huge resources to fabricate criminal cases against volunteers, not only in Russia, but also in Ukraine, using their covert agents of influence there. The same Russian forces initiate the defamation of Alatra volunteers in different countries through their agents. Facing open persecution on its volunteers, Alatra expanded its mission to include the protection of fundamental human rights and freedoms. In the face of escalating climate disasters, democratic values have become crucial for humanity's survival. Only in a free society, where the rights of each individual are protected, can there be that mutual understanding and interaction necessary to overcome the global climate and geodynamic crisis. Years of public surveys conducted by Alatra volunteers worldwide have shown that mutual understanding and respect are common values among the majority of people on Earth. Freedom and democracy are external expressions of these human qualities and must be guaranteed for all. Today, volunteers of the Alatra International Public Movement are active in 180 countries. The movement operates independently of politics and religion, receives no external funding, and does not represent any commercial or governmental structures. All initiatives are implemented solely through the efforts and resources of its volunteers. Alatra is open to everyone. Alatra volunteers pursue a common goal to minimize the damage to humanity from climate change and natural disasters. In an era of global climate and geodynamic changes, knowledge becomes the key to survival. The more people understand the actual situation, the better chance humanity has to preserve the life of each person. Alatra, people's lives, are the highest value.